Hi everyone, Karen Vizueta from Workout Hotel. Thank you for joining me today. We're doing an abs mini ball workout. So you need a little mini ball and a mat and we're going to get started. We're gonna go through each exercise for 40 seconds with a little 20 second transition time setting up for the next. All right, so we're thinking of core. We're gonna work the core effectively and safely. Let's go ahead and get started. Coming down to the mat, we're gonna begin with a bridge with the ball to the inner thighs, squeezing the glutes, we're lifting up those hips. So what I want you to focus here on hip bone staying level, draw the navel in and using that breath, right? So why are we doing a bridge here? Well, guess what? The abs, the back are a part of your core. So we're working to make sure we're effectively engaging the core. Doesn't mean we have to be in flexion all the time, right? Let's lift up, squeezing the glutes, getting ready to feel the burn. And two more, show me one more, and we're going to take that down. Hands are coming behind the head, chin is off our chest. Think of a little lemon here under chin and chest. Using that exhale, draw the waistline in, so I want you to feel that stabilization. Squeezing the ball just a little bit. Are we ready? We're gonna lift up, looking at the belly, lower that down. Let's go, keeping it nice and controlled, and down rising up. So notice we're not rushing through this. We're going to feel the ribs peeling down to the hip bones. Stay here for a minute. Think of those hip bones turning up like switches. Feel the belly engage more and come down. Little lift up and lower. All right? It's not about going fast. It's about keeping proper form and alignment, making sure we're not compensating, right? And using other muscles that aren't supposed to be working like our neck and head, right? Let's go, let's go. How did we do? And rest, nice job. We're gonna extend that right leg up to the ceiling. Now, if you're a little tight here, maybe that knee is going to be bent and I'm gonna give you options for this. Right palm is to the ball, left hand is behind your head. Chin is off chest, get ready. We're rolling up, using our abdominals and we're gonna press into the ball slightly and take that down lifting up. Now, if you're feeling super strong here and you need a little more, you're going to extend the left leg and holding that leg out there. And boy, do we feel the burn. If that's too much, that foot is coming down. Let's go. Let's go. Rolling little press into that ball. How are we doing? My friends getting warmed. We are working. My belly's burning already. Chin is off that chest. Look toward the belly using that exhale ribs are drawing down little press on that ball right to the finish i know it's burning and rest nice job little recovery getting ready for the other side so left palm is onto the ball onto that shin we're bending that knee if we need to right hand is behind our head chin is off chest shoulders off let's get ready inhale rising up on the exhale and come down and we're moving we got 40 seconds. Control that lift. Make sure we're not rocking from side to side. Think of lifting not with the neck and the head, but using the abdominal muscles. If you need a little more, let's go. We're powering that bottom leg, lengthening out. Oh yeah, it's burning. Lifting up. Keep stretching those legs long. Hold it on top, ooh, belly burner. Elbows wide on that right side. Harder when we go slow and rest. Way to work, lifting up your hips here. Now we're gonna place the small of the back right onto the ball, hands are down. I'll give you another option, right? If you need a little stability challenge, you're gonna bring those hands off. Option one, start with the upper back anchored, palms down, right leg is in, left leg is out. You're here, one knee in, and then we switch. Go slow, the key is to move nice and controlled here. Thumbs up position, right arm overhead, option two as left knee comes in and we switch. Not letting our hands touch the floor and switch. Nice long lines. All right, so when we're working the abs today, we're working that core. We're also thinking of the posterior, the back of those legs to lengthen tight hips that sometimes can pull on the low back, right? So we're working and thinking about alignment 
how we should be aligned, how we feeling, and rest. Nice job. All right, the next set, we got some scissors going on, so legs are straight. Again, challenging through the core. When the right leg comes up, we're flexing, and we're going to pulse for two with a little switch. Okay, that foot flexes, so we get that stretch. Get ready. Upper back anchored, then I'll give you option two. Right leg up, and left leg drops. Flex, flex, switch. Now, same thing as before, right? We're going to reach. Opposite arm and leg. Had to think about that one for just a moment. Reach. Shh. Just the legs are pulsing. Arms come overhead and down to the pocket. Oh, yeah. Remember, your hands might still be down on the floor on the mat. Little switch. Good, good. Right to the end. Right to the finish. Go, go, go. And we rest. How do we do? Nice job. We're coming all the way off from this position. Shoulders off those ears. Are we ready? We're going to take the ball right behind the small of that back with shoulders off those ears. Elbows are wide. Now, if you need to modify here, bring those hands to the floor. All right, I want that C curve, scooping the belly. Down an inch, exhale up an inch. Down an inch, exhale up an inch. The gaze is toward the navel. Good. Small movements right here. Lift. Ribs are coming to the hips. Use that exhale. Your abdominals should be burning, right? With these slow controlled movements today. Feeling that work. Oh, yes, we are. Right to the end. Let's go. Fight for it. You are strong. Go, go, go. Three, two, and rest. Nice work. All right, we're going to try for one leg. If that feels too much, you're bringing that down. So the right leg is going to go up. We're going to lift for two and switch. Left leg goes up. All right. If that doesn't work, arms are out. You're just going into the ball. Shoulders off those ears. Feet are parallel. Arms out. Scoop into the ball. Right leg off. Lift up. One. Lift up. Two, lower the leg down, left leg, lift up, one. Chest is lifting, two, lower the leg, right leg. <sighs> left leg, burning. If your abs are on fire, guys, I don't know. A few minutes out of your day, focus, draw your energy, your attention to making your body, your mind work in different ways every day. Yeah, good, good, good. Navel to spine, lift. How's that belly feeling? Mine is on fire and rest. Nice work. Take the ball a little bit higher here. So now it's between shoulder blades, yes? We're keeping it there and I want you to stay there. Hands are behind your head. Now we're gonna lift up to the curl. Hold, stay in flexion. Rotate from the rib cage to the right. We're gonna pulse one, two, come back to center. Pulse one, two, and turn to the left, lift, one, two. Back to center, chest lift, one, two. Twist to the right, slow, one, two. Back to center, lift, lift, it is small. To the left, obliques, obliques, and center. How are we feeling? Little lift. A little lift, we're gonna finish this one round right here. Good. Now, we're gonna meet up on our last one and rise. What I want you to do is bend your knees and our rib cage on the side is going to be on the ball. So your top hand is behind your head, your bottom arm is down, palm to the floor. No weight on that bottom shoulder, inhale. Exhale, top rib and hip, you're engaging the waist to bring them together. Feel that squeeze and lower. Exhale, little lift. Side bending and lower. Side bending. We're keeping it slow, yes? Now, I'm going to give you a little option. You're going to reach that arm over and side bend. Reach. Just lengthening that lever to get more of that stretch in that side body as you come down. Side. Elbow toward that hip. Bring it in and stretch. Bring it in. Beautiful work, everybody. Focus on getting through. 
the movement with control and we switch sides. How did that feel? Good. All right, we got the other side. We're gonna start with a bent knee, palm on the bottom, arm is down, shoulders off the ears. Find that flexion, inhale. Using that exhale, rib and hip are coming together. Lift, lift, lift. And lower down. Let's do it. We're coming up and lowering down. Picturing your body, your torso here between two walls. So we cannot move forward or back, right? Just side to side. Laterally flexing and down. And engaging that top waist, right? Now can we add on? You might stay or add that little reach. Stretch over, elbow comes in toward that hip. Beautiful. Lowering and exhale, lift. Stretch it over. Bring it in to the finish. And bring it in. We got one more. And bring it up. Way to work. The ball is coming to the side for a moment. We're going to do three little mountain climbers. And then the knee goes one elbow, the other elbow. Three mountain climber, climbers, elbow, elbow. All right. Now, if that feels too much, you can just add a knee extending back or maybe holding plank. We're going to go one, two. Now we hold on three. We go cross, cross, take it back. One, two. We hold on three. We cross, cross, take it back. Knee, knee. Hold on three. Cross, cross, and back. Finish strong. Good. Love those slow movements, those holds. That's where we feel that burn. Oh yeah. Focus to the finish. Hold, cross, cross. Knee, knee, it's a pause on three. Cross, cross, go. Knee, knee, it's a pause on three. Cross, cross, one more, one more. Cross, cross, and rest. Nice work. All right, we're finishing here. Two more exercises. We're starting in a forearm position. Shoulders off those ears. Here's your base move. Maybe you're just staying here, scooping up that belly button, tucking the toes and lifting up. Now we're gonna make a rainbow. Right hip down, up and over, left hip down. Right, using that waist. Right and left. And right, lifting with the side waist and left. Lifting up that floor. Right, dropping that waist, lift, left down and up little rainbow maybe you're just holding plank my waist is on fire how are we feeling we are almost there little rainbows down lift it up left side exhale stabilizing and rest nice job so we're going to take the ball anytime we do flexion Right, we did a lot of coming forward. We also did some isometric work. We're gonna counteract with extension work. So working in the reverse. Hands are on the ball, legs are long, shoulders off. We never wanna jolt the head and neck up. The gaze is down, inhale. We're gonna exhale, lift. Squeezing the glutes, feel that stretch in the front abdominal wall and return. Gliding the shoulders down and back, lift and return continuing here squeezing underneath the armpits lifting the heart and chest and lower we go again rising up 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 to the top lifting 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 and return take it down let's go one more and let that go. My friends, we are done with our little mini ball abdominal core focus work out today. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. Be sure to give it a big thumbs up. If you did like this video, subscribe to Work a Hotel. And we are in our April Spring Clean Your Fitness Routine challenge where I give you a calendar, live workouts on demand. We do some really cool, fun things. So if you're interested in leveling up, your workout routine, your fitness program. Join us now. I'm going to put the link down below. It's only $9.99 every single month. My friends, it's workouts like this that are longer. I go more in depth giving presentations. So you're not only just doing the workouts, but you're learning why and the hows and what muscles are weak, what muscles are strong and foam rolling, mobility. We go through it all. So think about 
taking your workout to the next level, join below. You guys are awesome. Have a beautiful day. Have a blessed day. And I will see you all next workout. Take care, everybody. Thanks for watching.